The Spirit of God is constantly at work in our lives. In one small instant, the Holy Spirit ignited a spark of imagination in Ada Beck that began a new congregation in Elgin, a congregation that would worship with the faith of the parents in the language of the children. Our church members lived through several wars, the Great Depression, epidemics that forced the closing of Sunday school for a time, a Palm Sunday tornado that damaged many parishioners' homes, and a fire in the boiler room. Pastor Armin Wang noted in our parish register that even at the height of the Great Depression, we closed the books without a deficit and with nearly $2,000 paid in benevolence. During these years, attendance continued to grow, and in 1933, over 2,000 people called Holy Trinity home. We thank God for the strength and generosity of those who have gone before us. Throughout the generations, the people of Holy Trinity have been amazing. Through good times and bad, the Holy Spirit has been guiding and leading us to build upon the ministry that began over 113 years ago. We know that our great cloud of witnesses is cheering us on as we run with perseverance the race that is set before us. Thanks be to God. As we remember our past, we honor those who have gone before us. Ada Beck, the 41 founding members, and hundreds and then thousands who would become members of Holy Trinity. We honor those who taught Sunday school, those who had the imagination to dig a basement under the sanctuary after it was built those who sang and played instruments to the glory of God, those who maintained the building and grounds, those who became ministers and missionaries, those who filled the pews every time there was a worship service, those who called on others when they were sick, those who helped three new churches come into being, and those whose imagination sparked a ministry that is as vibrant today as it was when Holy Trinity began in 1903.